Oh my gosh, I had just gotten my prom dress and I was eating dinner with my family. We had in and out for dinner. I got a double-double, I ate it. And then I decided that it would be a really good idea to try on my prom dress. And I didn't fit into my dress and so I had a panic attack and my mom had to be like, are you okay, are you okay? In any sort of situation where there's some sort of emotional thing that's happening, I like deal with it by like talking about it online to my Twitter followers, which is what I did. I tweeted, crying in a prom dress, what a mood. Wait, I'm gonna write a song about that. Don't steal my idea. And then a year later, I successfully did it. Yeah. Prom Dress was produced by Cave Town, um, Robin Skinner. I did it remotely. We, he lives in London and I live in the Bay Area of California. The production process was interesting. It was just like emails and texts about certain things that I wanted to have happen in the song. He kind of took it and ran with it and put in a lot of ideas and was like, are you okay with this? And I was just open to pretty much anything at that point and it sounds amazing, yeah. I'm nearing the end of my fourth year. I feel like I've been lacking, crying too many tears. I mean, high school in general isn't good for anybody, right? I mean, I, I think I really felt it in my final year. You think a lot about what the future holds for you when you're, when you're at the end of your experience in high school, and I was thinking a lot about it. I was making music, and I didn't know what I wanted to do for college. I don't know, I'd be surprised if someone says they have a flawless high school experience. I'd like to hear their story, yeah. <laughs> Everyone seemed to say it was so great. But did I miss out? Was it a huge mistake? I can't help the fact I like to be alone. It might sound kind of sad, but that's just what I seem to know. I'm a total introvert. Everyone in my immediate family is an introvert. We all hang out at home with each other and just watch like Netflix and, and don't leave the house. It's kind of bad. I love alone time. I think like I kind of require it to a certain extent because be doing music and stuff is such like a social job and like posting all the time on social media or like going to meetings and stuff. It's, I love doing those things, but I also at a certain point need to like go lie down in my bed and like pretend the world is just turned off for like a quick second. I tend to handle things usually by myself and I can't ever seem to try and ask for help. Admitting that you need somebody's advice on something is sometimes one of the toughest things to do and I think it's a learning experience that everyone goes through is just being okay with seeking outside opinions and you know people just lending a helping hand. I'm sitting here crying in my prom dress I'd be the prom queen if crying was a contest When I wrote those two lines I just felt like there was something like deeply ironic about like this article of clothing that is representative of the greatest time that you're ever gonna have in high school and then to have somebody that's like wearing it having one of the worst times of their life Makeup is running down Feelings are all around How did I get here? I need to know I I guess I maybe had a couple expectations. Even though I was an introvert and I definitely like straight away from like party scenes or whatever, like thinking about high school it would be one of those things where like I'd go out with my friends on Friday night and like, you know, I don't know, do fun stuff. I just never did that anyways. But like I, I had like all these sorts of weird expectations from like high school musical or like other teen movies that I watched that I was like, ah yeah, like people are gonna break out into song and dance during our lunch breaks. Any sort of thing that you go into in your life, you probably want it to be the best possible scenario. But you know, life's just not like that. Thought I'd get to them, but no I didn't. I guess I thought that prom was gonna be fun, but now I'm sitting on the floor and all I wanna do is run. 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 I haven't actually thought about where I'd run to. I think like the idea of moving away from something was mostly why I wrote that line. In the concept of, of escaping, I just would want to be in a safe space. So if that was like at home with my parents or maybe with my friends or being alone, I think just escaping whatever situation that feels hard to deal with in that moment. I keep collections of masks upon my wall to try and stop myself from revealing it all. Music was my escape to be authentically myself. I think in life, we often as individuals wear facades for the sake of other people and, and also for ourselves, to guard ourselves from other people. I've definitely walked through the world sometimes wearing a mask so that way I can kind of hide my emotions. I feel like writing about it in a song is important because then it brings that 
fact into other people's lives and they can understand that and know that they're not alone with that because that was something that I felt like I was dealing with by myself when I was writing the song. Affecting others is the last thing I would do. I keep to myself though I want to break through. I hold so many small regrets. I think about some of the decisions I made in high school or the lack thereof of decisions. Like I'm an introverted person and I didn't really put myself in like maybe more social situations or whatever. And I think because of that, I felt like left out a lot of the quintessential high school experience. I mean, I just think like as a person, I definitely ponder the hypotheticals a whole lot, maybe too much. And what is down inside my head? Some confidence, it couldn't hurt me. My demeanor is often misread. I did go to my prom. I actually had a blast at my prom, which is, you know, hypocritical because of this song. I went with friends. I had a great time. I took photos. I looked bomb. It was great. Prom as an idea is so big and it's supposed to be this great event that everybody has like a blast at and I'm thankful I had a good experience, but there's also moments where it feels really tough and high school is in general, I think, you know, you watch like the teen movies about high school and how everyone's like dancing on tables and like having the greatest times of their lives and like that's so inaccurate. I only stayed at my prom for an hour. <laughs> I left at 10.30, I ate the free food, I talked with my friends, I did the cha-cha slide and the cupid shuffle, and then I bounced out of the prom. My mom picked me up, it was great. <laughs>